So over the weekend, I had gone to a comedy show with some friends of mine and we went to see Mark Lottring. And I'm sure everybody knows his name. He's a huge comedian in South Africa and I love him. This is the second time I've seen him live and he's hilarious. He's witty, he's intelligent, he's got a lifetime worth of things to say. And best of all, he's funny while he's saying it. But through the hilarity and the laughs, he's mentioned a few things that I would like to mention. And one of the things that he said was celebrate your successes, but your own successes, not always everybody else's. We are quick to be modest um, in attempt to look modest, but if we don't celebrate the things that um, we do, who's going to? I mean, you're not going to tell your friends to throw you a surprise party when you turn 21 or 30 or whatever the case is. They're going to do it for you. However, you can still enjoy your birthday. And I really, um, I really took from this because, I mean, this man has been doing this for 21 years, uh, this May. So he knows what he's talking about, right? And I don't understand why we don't like celebrating the things that we have accomplished. Because they've taken time, they've taken effort. It's been something that um, we've put our heart and soul into. And yet, we just let it slide. And this happens all the time and I see myself doing it. There's little things that give me this little thrill and I want to do this happy dance and I want to jump all over the place and then I'm like, no, let me not say anything besides to, to, to my, my husband or my sisters or my mother or whatever because in case people think I'm bragging. But I'm going to try and change that because you can celebrate things and you can pass on things that are important to you without bragging, right? It's just about the way you say it and what you say. There's so many things that I think we have achieved in our lives that we don't uh, give enough credit to ourselves for. There's so many things that we could do better um, and then we do it better and we just let it slide. I mean, what's the point? What is the point of going through life and going through all the things that we do if we don't celebrate the small things? So for this week, anything small that happens or anything big that happens, I'm going to celebrate. And I usually do, but I just celebrate it internally or I celebrate it um, with my close circle. But I think I'm going to I'm going to celebrate things in, in, a, in a bigger way. Sometimes I actually do brag, uh, like when Whoopi Goldberg wished me for my birthday. But... Um, <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to try and do stuff that I enjoy and let people know that I'm doing it right and, and that it's come to that so what I want you to do is I want you to do the same thing please let me know what are you celebrating what have you accomplished what have you done that is important to you that you would like the whole world to know I mean if Mark Lottering could sit with me for five minutes I would tell him kudos to you dude you you're amazing I mean he's the epitome of always be you and if he is right about if he says this then he must be right I mean why are we going wrong with this so please remember to like comment and share your engagement means a lot to me it shows me that you are listening to me and that I have something worthy to say so comment as much as you can and share my videos I'd really like the right people to see it and if you have anything to know uh, anything you want to say anything you want me to talk about please let me know and remember this is Arini always be you